YouTube Dark Show here, and I'm going to be doing a video review of Marvel Mini Mates Wave 25 Insulated Spider Man and Electro 2 Pack. So, um, here's the box uh, art. You have a nice picture of the Spider Man art drawn. Very nice. And Electro. It says 2 Pack, whatever. Uh, it's orange, and shows some comic pictures of them. Good day, Electro. Spidey. I don't know why they're Spider Woman. Please tell me why. Uh, also, I'm sorry for the bad quality for my last mini mate review. I'm so sorry. That was like really bad quality. Um, there's Electra. And here's Insulated Spider Man. But this one's actually darker than the, how he really looks like. So here we have all the characters in the wave. And it says Insulated Spider Man. And for the, I mean, for the bio. Let's get to the bio before we do that. This is Insulated Spider-Man. Alternate costume was created by Spider-Man to counter the devastating electricity powers of the supervillain Electro by utilizing non-conductive materials and building on his original rubber air mattress design. He defeated Electro with ease. Now for Electro. Given superhuman powers by a freak electrical accident, Max Dillon was transformed from an average electric company lineman to the supervillain known as Electro. Able to absorb and manipulate near limitless amounts of electricity, Electro can only be defeated by sh shorting out or overloading his powers. Uh, so the other mini mates in the line is Spider-Man, Spider-Woman. Oh, the number two, that's Variant. Pretty sure that's Variant. Yeah, it's Variant. Uh, his name expects me at the moment. I'll put an annotation. Seeing his name, I'm really sorry. Uh, Spider Woman. Electro. Is it like Spidey? Electro. I mean, I mean uh, Scorpion. And also then Spider Man. Oh, that's a Vault card. I mean, Vault card. Sorry. Uh, visit Diamond Side Toys and Art Asylum for more info on all our mini mates. And then. Damn, it's like toys, art asylum, comic book finder, collect them all. Ball, nah, okay. Also comes with a standard, uh, all the mini mates, Marvel mini mates, I mean. Damn, it's like toys, questionnaire, little diorama, and the upcoming toy for us, please. So let's start off with Insulated Spider-Man. So this is Insulated Spider-Man. He looks really not nice. There's really no bad paint apps with this figure. Uh, he looks... I never really read, I'm sorry, but I never read an Insulated Spider-Man. Uh, I mean, a Spider-Man comic with him using this outfit. Because I never really read any of the older comics. Um, but from the other toys I've seen of him, he looks spot on. Uh, he has not, I don't know, okay, someone please tell me why he's like two diamonds there, but he looks sick though. Um, he has a spot on Spider-Man face. Yeah, spot on. I guess that's for the electricity. Nice. There. Black, li uh, red lines. And yeah, he looks very nice. Um, he has no bad paint apps. It's kind of sad he didn't continue all the way to the back, but hey, it's really displayed at the front, not the back. Um, for his and uh, for his articulation, so he could go around, but it makes that weird sound. I've been trying to move it around for a couple minutes now, and I don't know why. Up and down. Uh, sand could go around. Set side. Bend at the elbow, his arms can move 360 degrees, his waist can move 360 degrees, his legs can go in and out, side to side, bend at the knee, and his feet can rotate. Just that I don't want to move his feet or his arms because they might fall off. Now he looks um, really good. Um, he also comes with an insulated spotting mask. Uh, it's just Blue mask, I mean, blue eyes. I mean, 
blue mask, white eyes. From the comic book picture, the figure looks pretty accurate, but... Uh, let's put his hat on. Oh, what's weird is that he has this little thing right here, and his pig is, like, quite different, and it fits smoggy in his head, like, really good in his head, but on any other figure, it kind of, it doesn't want to stay on. But I uh, hear, here's how he looks with the insulated Spartan mask on. Pretty sick. If I have to display him, it'll be like that, so it looks more of a Spider-Man-ish. But, uh, now let's move on to a Electro. Electro is one of the reasons I bought this set. He looks amazing. You know, I'm pretty sure all of you have seen Electro before, read of him, uh, or seen him in the show. But he just looks amazing. Like, oh, it's crazy. But, um, uh, here we have his normal hat that he wears. Very nice. Um, electric shocks, just like it's displayed in the comic. Kind of see your aggression on it. It's black at the back, but that's how it looks like in the comics, so hey. Whatever. Um, there's a pig inside of there. Hole in his head. But, uh, Max Dillon is bald. Knew that. Um, very mad face on. But very sinister looking. Very nice face. Detail. Uh, now for his, uh, chest, he has very nice, okay, no homo there, no homo, but he has nice detail on his abs, uh, normal stripes, green, I love these, uh, this, I mean, uh, the gloves, can't really take that part off, you could take the hands off, of course, but, nice electrical shock at the side, um, yeah, he just looks amazing, same articulation as Spider-Man, um, it's Kind of hindered by that though, but some articulation. There's no need to double show you. Um, and for the way of accessories, I didn't even know he came with these. But these amazing two of these blasts. They're very well detailed, fluorescent. They look very nice, and we just put them in between, right here, uh, right there. Uh, I just go like that. You have a shock on him. Um, same thing. The other side. It's really easy. If I'm making it look hard, I'm sorry. I'm putting it the wrong way. Yeah, I'm putting it the wrong way. Sorry, guys. This may happen putting it the wrong way, but. There you go. So, damn, he looks really badass. Even if you take his head off, it's like, huh. An amazingly detailed. Sorry. He just looks amazing. Just playing in Spider Man. This set is an amazing two pack. I mean, just for Electro, he's like, I would, I would give it a 20 out of, 20, uh, 20 out of 10. I mean, crazy. And it, it's like Spider Man's a nice feature. He doesn't really have anything special to him, but he's still pretty cool. Um, so overall, this set is a must buy if you're, uh, is, is a must buy if you're, um, a Mini Meat fan, or if you're an Electro fan, because this is clearly an Electro set. Now, these are also good for stop motion, so if you're a stop motion maker, get the pack, because he just, just for the electric shocks that he comes with, is good for, uh, is good to get, so, uh, yeah, this set is amazing, I mean, speechless, uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed my review, and, uh, yeah, stay tuned for more mini mate reviews, and there's nothing much else to say, just go get this pack, okay, bye.